12 it is Monday Monday evening uh, I'm out late dinner late dinner I'm not gonna lie to you but I'm, I came by I saw Fazoli's had some new items and I'm sitting in drive through and I look up and I was gonna do this new bacon mac and cheese but I look up and they have a new lobster mac and cheese and it looks like it's eight dollars ninety nine cents I do not know how many calories are yet or anything I'm gonna try to find that out for you guys but tonight guys here for Zoli's, we're gonna try the new lobster mac and cheese. New limited time, whatever it is. We're gonna try it. I'm gonna get it and I'll have it right, guys, right when I get back. I have got it right here in my hand. This is the lobster mac and cheese, new lobster mac and cheese, cost you eight dollars and ninety-nine cents from right there at Fazoli's. It has around, I have figured out it has around six hundred and eighty calories, around that. Okay. Um so they give you a nice little fancy thing. And they give you this, I think it goes at the bottom of the bag. But also, guys, this thing's really hot, so this works good. Uh, I don't know if that's exactly what it's for, but I'm using it for that. So you can actually get it out and hold it. Otherwise, this is too hot to hold, this little tin pan here. But for $8.99, what you get is this, which is the lobster mac and cheese. And those little pieces right there, those little red-looking pieces, they're not a spice. That's the cut-up lobster. And then... You get two breadsticks that come in this bag. So, that's what you get for $8.99. It's a pretty good amount. So, eh, you know, it's lobster though, right? So, here we go. Let's try this lobster mac and cheese from Fazoli's. I'm going to get a bite right there. You see the red piece there with the mac and cheese. That's the lobster. So, I'm going to get me a first bite. It's actually going to have some lobster on it. Here we go. Definitely cheesy. Okay. I like what it's doing. I don't like it's burning my freaking hand. <laughs> and keep moving that little white protective thing down there. If not, it's that third degree burns. But I, I do like what it's doing. I like what I like what it tastes like. Mm. Not once I've ever thought about putting seafood on my mac and cheese. Camera mom, have you ever thought about putting seafood on your mac and cheese? Mm. You really gonna ask me that? Yeah, she doesn't. The person like seafood. who doesn't eat seafood. But I mean, even if you don't like seafood, have you ever thought about anybody putting any type of seafood on a mac and cheese? I don't know. I don't no. even like chicken in my mac and cheese. <laughs> I was getting ready to say that a lot of people have jumped on some mac and cheese things. KFC's got one with chicken in it, obviously. But I bet you this is something that maybe like in Maine, you know, up there in Maine, lobster area, you know, by New York and all that, right? I bet you they have something like this, probably. Mm -hmm. But this is good. If you like lobster... But you want more lobster flavor, you're going to have to tell them to put extra lobster. There's not much lobster on here. But you can still get the taste of lobster. It is cheesy. It's a good mac and cheese. Um, and they're not skimping on how many noodles they put in there and cheese. That's the cheapest thing they can put in there. But they do skimp a little bit on the mac, or on the lobster part. It's the only thing I did not like. But the flavors are good together. I, I definitely would buy this again. So, I like it. So, let's take it back to school. Okay? Let's let's take it back to school. Let's give it a grade. You know, in school, you can get an A. That's your best you can do. Or you can get an F. And you know every other grade in between. So, with this lobster mac and cheese at Red Lo at well, almost said Red Lobster. <laughs> with this mac and cheese from Fazoli's. I bet you that's another place you could get a uh, lobster mac and cheese. But, anyways... This mac and cheese here. Lobster mac and cheese from Fazoli's. I'm going to give it 
a solid B. I'm going to give it a B. I'm not going to give it an A, only because I felt like for the price of $8.99, I'm not saying I should have got a monster amount of lobster, but maybe a tad bit more. That, that's what I'm looking well, for. Well, see, even in the picture, they show chunks of mac and cheese. Of lobster. lobster. But here these, these look like little shriveled up shrimp. But uh, yeah. But I mini can, shrimp. But I can taste it. I mean it's there. It, it or is lobster. Mini octopus tentacles. <laughs> but I'm gonna give it a B. If it had slightly a little bit more lobster pieces, I would give it or a Or larger. Or larger. I'd give it an A. But I don't mind the price. It tastes good. Let's see. Hold on. So, that's, that's... That right there is the size of the lobster pieces. But it, it, but it does to, def, it, uh, to, you know, to, uh... That one's a little longer, but... To back it up, though... skinny little pieces. But to back it up, though, it still tastes good, and that's why it's going to get a B. Because overall, the appearance, minus the lobster not being a certain size or not giving enough, it tastes good it tastes good and i would give it a solid b you know it's a good grade i think it can improve if they put just a little bit more lobster on it so all right guys that's all we have tonight we reviewed the fazoli's lobster mac and cheese and it was really delicious i gave it a b you know i'd buy it again so don't forget to like subscribe comment and share and i'll see you guys probably around friday or so until then happy eating be safe Go out and try this Fazoli's Lobster Mac and Cheese because it's really good. All right, guys. Later.